Hello, I'm Dylan Jacobs, men's hockey reporter for the Daily Collegian. I'm Ben Free, men's hockey reporter for the Daily Collegian. And I'm Patrick Burns, men's hockey reporter for the Daily Collegian. So Penn State taking on Denver this weekend, a rematch of the team that ended Penn State's season last year. DJ, what are you looking for this Saturday in Allentown? I mean, Denver has some of the most skilled players in the entire country. They have guys like Troy Terry and Henrik Borkstrom, two guys who average over a point per game. And they're going to be really tough for Penn State to match up with. And they're going to have to find a way to stop them if Penn State wants to move on. For me, it's will Penn State have a home ice advantage in Allentown? They're hosting the Midwest region, a lot of very close to the Penn State campus. Will Penn State have a home ice advantage? And it's for, me, so close to home? for me, you mentioned Terry and Borgstrom. It's the impact that Pavlichev and Penn State's decor will make because Denver will have the first change. So Penn State won't be able to have the kind of matchups that they want to get, per se. Um, so who are you predicting to win the game and why? I actually think Penn State gets the win in this game. I think they've been waiting for this moment for over a year. Uh, they've said all season long that they took learning experiences from that game last year, and I think they're going to use it, use that redemption factor to get a win. So I think Denver's going to pull through in this game. Penn State's just not quite at that level yet. They won't be able to shut down Borgstrom and Terry. Yeah, I'm also going with Denver. Um, I think it's going to be a tight one. I'm actually predicting an overtime thriller. But, uh, you know, Penn State, they have the ability to beat Denver. I just think Denver, uh, they've got the experience. They've made 11 straight NCAA tournaments. They won last year. Troy Terry, everyone knows what he can do in the clutch. So I'm going to go with Denver. I'm actually picking Denver to win it all. What about you guys? Uh, I think the winner of the whole thing is going to be St. Cloud State. Uh, I think they run through their regional and kind of like some home ice advantage for them in the Frozen Four. I think they'll be able to hold on. I think Penn State will make it to the Frozen Four because I think after this game is Denver, uh, Ohio State and Princeton, Penn State matches up really well yeah, against. I agree with that. But I think St. Cloud State is the team that I think is going to win it all. Yeah. For me, I have to agree with you, Pat. I think Denver is going to advance. Um, they match up again favorably well with Ohio State and Princeton. They will go on to win back-to-back -back NCAA championships. Yep, I've got Denver over St. Cloud State and then also them meeting up against Notre Dame in the championship, Denver winning it all. Thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned to all of our content from Allentown this weekend.